This is a short instructional video for Spectralis users on how to acquire macular and retinal nerve fiber layer scans. This will comprise the use of line, volume and circumferential scans, automatic real-time and live eye tracking. After welcoming the patient, the patient should be seated at the Spectralis instrument and the headrest cleaned in accordance with local infection control policy. Patient details should be entered into the Hiac software and the image acquisition module started. The appropriate funder's imaging modality should be selected and the headrest should be adjusted so the outer canthus of the eye lines up with the mark on the headrest. The patient should be instructed to look at the internal fixation target. The funder's image is aligned by sliding the camera head forward, keeping the reflex from the patient's pupil central. The fundus image should be evenly illuminated from edge to edge. The patient should be encouraged to blink during the examination. The fundus image should be checked for sharp focus and adjusted accordingly. The instrument should be moved forward to visualise the OCT image and position in the sweet spot indicated by the blue brackets. The live eye tracking and automatic real-time modes are engaged with a long press of the joystick button. The horizontal line scan quality should be allowed to build to an ART value of 100. The image is then acquired with a short press of the joystick button. The vertical scan should then be selected, again allowing the ART value to build to 100 before acquiring the image. Select a volume scan from the Retina preset menu Eye tracking and automatic real-time are engaged upon pressing the acquire button. To assess the retinal nerve fibre and ganglion cell layer, first select the posterior pole scan from the glaucoma presets. The scan should be acquired and the position of the OCT should be monitored during the acquisition. Select the retinal nerve fibre scan and instruct the patient to follow the fixation target. The live eye tracking should be engaged and the scan centred on the nerve head. The image quality should be allowed to build to 100 before acquiring the image. The images should be saved and the patient should be instructed to relax and sit back from the instrument. The OCT scans demonstrated in this video are not intended to be exhaustive, but represent a useful starting point for anybody embarking on OCT assessment of patients.